the GATE 2010 EC branch solutions. Topic we are discussing is electron devices. In that one we are discussing two marks questions. This is third two marks question which is considered as a linked questions three and four. But now we will discuss three. In the next video we will discuss four. The silicon sample with unit cross sectional area shown below is in thermal equilibrium. The following information is given. T is equal to 300 degree Kelvin. Electron, electron charge 1.6 into 10 power minus 19 coulombs. Thermal voltage 26 millivolts. Electron mobility 1350 cm square per volt second. So this is a diagram. A silicon sample with ND is given. That is nothing but it is N type sample. For that one we applied a 1 volt voltage. And here the length of semiconductor is nothing but 1 micrometer. You need to calculate the magnitude of electric field at x is equal to 0.5 micrometers. Magnitude of electric field at x is equal to 0.5 micrometers is a 1 kilovolt per centimeter, b 5 kilovolts per centimeter, c 10 kilovolts per centimeter, d 26 kilovolts per centimeter. The right answer is c 10 kilovolts per centimeter because the silicon sample is under thermal equilibrium and whenever it is in thermal equilibrium it is going to be the electric field is going to be distributed throughout the semiconductor as uniform so uniform electric field electric field at every point is same and electric field always directed from positive to negative that is in case of p injunction it is always from n to p now look at this one the electric field at x is equal to 1 micrometer the voltage across this point is 1 volt and distance is 1 micrometer here electric field can be written as electric field units are volt per meter so electric field can be calculated by voltage by distance between the plates so distance of semiconductor and applied voltage v by x v is 1 volt by 1 micrometer that is 10 power 6 volt per meter if you are converting meter into centimeters at that time this is 100 centimeters that is 10 square centimeters that 10 square if it is going up at that time it will become 10 power 4 volt per centimeter which is nothing but 10 power 4 is nothing but 10 kilo volts per centimeter so the electric field is going to be 10 kilo volts and since it is under thermal equilibrium it is constant throughout the semiconductor even if it is at x is equal to 0.5 micrometers it is at point x is equal to 0.2 micrometers or 0.8 micrometers because if you look at this one let us assume at x is equal to 0.5 assume this n type semiconductor distributed resistor by the time till x is equal to 0.5 micrometers the voltage present during this distance is 0.5 volts only 0.5 volts divided by 0.5 micrometers is nothing but again it is 10 kilo volts per centimeter so electric field throughout the semiconductor is constant so the right answer for our question is c 10 kilovolts per centimeter thank you